So today in this guy's garage, we're going to be treating uh, some rust around a gas door. It's an issue I'm having on my 2005 Mustang, but it's an issue on multiple vehicles. Uh, grease and grime and dirt just seem to get lodged in there, and if you're going to get rust, it's going to go in around the gas door. Today I'm going to take the easy method. I'm going to descale it with some air, and uh, I'm going to apply some of this rust fix treatment. And the only reason I'm even willing to give this a try is because this toolbox that's behind me here, I grabbed it out of uh, my dad's old shop there about a year ago and it's been sitting in my damp garage for more than a year and it's only been treated with rust fix so I thought this would be a great place to give it a try let's show you how to apply it so the way you'd normally go at this would be with a sandblaster I'm gonna clean this out with an air hose and I'm gonna put a coating of this on it prime it and paint it Stick around for the next episode because that's when we'll be priming and painting. If you have the means, I would encourage you to sandblast it and prime it and paint it, but not everybody's equipped with them tools, so we need workarounds, right? If you don't have access to an air hose, go to a pressure wash, or if you have a pressure washer, you can use water. As you can see in here, it's already turning black. So we're gonna leave this coating sit overnight. Come back tomorrow, we'll be showing you what you need to prep for paint. I'm gonna be using the Nico HVLP touch-up gun. But you can use a spray bomb to do a repair such as this. I won't judge you. What goes on behind closed doors isn't any of my business. So thanks again for stopping by this guy's garage. If this video helped you out some, you can hit that subscribe button right there. It helps us out a whole lot. Smash that like button, that's the next best thing you can do to help us out. And until the next time, folks, this guy is. It ain't easy being cheesy.